there's nothing more addictive than a gooey, cheesy jalapeno popper, right? I mean, anything deep fried and filled with cheese is great in my book. Well, today I'm gonna make something that's probably like 75% as addictive. It's a jalapeno popper, but instead of frying it, I'm going to roast it. You could also grill them, so they're variable, but they are just a little bit healthier than your deep fried versions, but just as delicious. Start off by removing the seeds from your jalapenos. That's where most of the spiciness is, and if your jalapenos are really spicy, that can be super duper spicy. So remove those, and if you want to, you can leave the little stems on, or you can take them off, that's up to you. Line these up on a baking sheet. I have a total of six jalapenos that have been halved and seeded. For the filling, combine half a cup of grated sharp cheddar cheese and four ounces of cream cheese. You season this with salt and pepper. If you were a super spice head, I suppose you could add like hot sauce or something to this, but I'm here to tell you that these jalapenos that I have today are already spicy enough. Fill your jalapenos with the cheese mixture. Spicy jalapeno and gooey melty cheese. It'd be a really fun barbecue appetizer. Have your oven at 450 degrees, and these get baked until the cheese is bubbling and the chilies have softened a little bit, about 10 minutes. You might wanna let them cool off just a tiny bit before you take a bite. Mm. So good. Cheesy, delicious jalapeno poppers. Super easy, too. Cheesy, easy jalapeno poppers. Hi guys, thanks for watching this video. Be sure to click here if you want to subscribe and click over here if you want to continue watching more great videos like this.